you could be in the north, um, where the mountains are, you know, and have the alpine um, winter, uh, and on the same day take a train down to uh, Sorrento or Capri and, and be in shorts. So it's fantastic that it's such a variance, and, um, and culture and regions um, tend to um, offer you a lot of different sort of uh, cultural experiences as well. So you can travel to Italy um, in a week. It will give you major cities. Uh, you might be able to see Venice, Florence, and Rome. Um, you wouldn't want to stretch yourself too thin because it's uh, quite a big country and there will be a lot of driving or train transportation if, if that's the case. Um, but yeah, you could. Ideally, I recommend 10 to 12 days. By all means, a coach tour is great. Uh, for those more independent travelers, I do recommend renting a car and doing it on your own if you'd like to do bed and breakfast or if you're going to do maybe um, sort of a villa in Tuscany and, and do sightseeing from there. Car rental tends to be a little bit more expensive. Um, motor coach, of course, is always the best way to go. Um, just takes you so point A to point B um, without any hassles and you get to enjoy the countryside. You know, a lot of the hotels in Italy are, have been around for a very long time, it, especially if you're in the city centre. When you get to the outskirts of town, then you find sort of a newer, modern type accommodations. Again, there's anywhere from a two-star lead-in, hostel type accommodation, all the way up to five, six-star, you know, blue ribbon, uh, deluxe uh, luxury hotels. So it just depends on what sort of accommodation you want to experience. Definitely, if you veer off the beaten track, you can find a lot of interesting restaurants that are going to give you great value for your money. I mean, the wine is, is less expensive than water. Um, but again, I always encourage clients to, you know, speak to uh, some of the locals that live there. Find out where uh, a good place would be to, uh, to have a nice dinner. And again, of course, all the main attractions will have uh, restaurants nearby, which will be, uh, could be 50 to $60 more uh, for a nice dinner than maybe scoping out something off the beaten track and um, still enjoying the culture and having a great meal. Traveling to Italy, yes, definitely uh, can be a family vacation as well as, um, you know, an individual trip or as a group. Um, it's, it's great culture. Um, they definitely have a lot of sites that children would um, definitely benefit from, educational-wise, history. Um, I mean, there are, uh, again, extensive beaches there, so you can have a portion of your vacation as a beach stay, a relaxing time in a villa, and uh, again, sightseeing, hiking, is, is just breathtaking.